Hello and welcome. This is your teacher, Madeline. This is the speaking practice for the IELTS exam. Below are some of the topics that the examiner will ask. Today's topic is transportation. Before we begin, I left you a link in the below video description for a dictionary to look up any unfamiliar words and expand your vocabulary. Let's begin. How did you come here today? How did you come here today? How did you get here today? How did you get here today? I took a train to get here. The commute wasn't long. It took about 30 minutes. Public transportation is the cheapest way to travel for me. I took a train to get here. The commute wasn't long. It took about 30 minutes. Public transportation is the cheapest way to travel for me. I live far from here, so I had to take the train and then a bus. The bus stop was 10 minutes away from here, and I walked the rest of the way. I live far from here, so I had to take the train and then a bus. The bus stop was 10 minutes away from here, and I walked the rest of the way. What is public transport like in your town? What is public transport like in your town? There are not many public transportation available in my small town. We have some buses, but most people drive a car or ride their bicycle to get around. There are not many public transportation available in my small town. We have some buses, but most people drive a car or ride their bicycle to get around. I live in a big city, so public transportation is always crowded and at times not reliable. The vast amount of people makes it challenging to get to your destination on time. I live in a big city, so public transportation is always crowded and at times not reliable. The vast amount of people makes it challenging to get to your destination on time. How do you think it could be improved? How do you think it could be improved? It is difficult to say because our government has invested much resources in improving it. However, there are millions of people traveling every day. Fortunately, we have a wide choice of transport, but it is the increased number of the population that slows down the commute. It is difficult to say because our government has invested much resources in improving it. However, there are millions of people traveling every day. Fortunately, we have a wide choice of 
transport, but it is the increased number of the population that slows down the commute. Perhaps if they increase service by adding more routes, it will help improve it. Also, adding a more efficient bus ticketing system can speed up the service. Perhaps if they increase service by adding more routes, it will help improve it. Also, adding a more efficient bus ticketing system can speed up the service. Do you think people should use public transport more? Why? Why not? Do you think people should use public transport more? Why? Why not? Absolutely, because public transport is more environmentally friendly than private cars. Since a larger amount of people can ride it, the carbon emissions per person is largely reduced. Absolutely, because public transport is more environmentally friendly than private cars. Since a larger amount of people can ride it, the carbon emissions per person is largely reduced. Unfortunately, for many people, public transportation is not as convenient as using their private vehicle. But as we know, public transportation is better for the environment. Those who use their vehicle to commute can consider electric cars that do not burn any fuel. They run solely on electricity. Unfortunately, for many people, public transportation is not as convenient as using their private vehicle. But as we know, public transportation is better for the environment. Those who use their vehicle to commute can consider electric cars that do not burn any fuel. They run solely on electricity. Please review these tips to help you practice and prepare for the speaking portion of the exam. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, and leave your comment. Wish you all success.